So welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back. Today, we're taking on the Manchester City. And then we're taking on Wolves uh, away from, no, at home. So Etihad and then back at Old Trafford. We're doing this right after the last episode. So I'm zoned in and hopefully it's going to be a belter. We have got the highest team spirit, I think, that we've ever had this season so far. We are still playing that 3-5-2. It might be a gamble, folks, but we're going to do what we have to do. So this is the lineup that we're looking at. 94 on the spirit. Whether the team's going to feel like that, I've no idea. Look, Pez has always had a handicap. Doesn't matter what you play on. There's always going to... There is a there is a shift. It's still an eFootball, and I'm sure you guys notice it. Like, your team will feel fantastic. Everything's working on the controller. And then there'll be moments for 10, 15 minutes, and I'm talking about in-game minutes, where your team feels like pants. If you can get through that, then your team will start feeling better again. So it's like... I don't know. There's something in pairs, and I think that's why we all come back and play it, because it, it it does something to make the games very realistic, you know, but I don't know. They, they do something behind the code. So anyway, today, Bayern D is back in goal. We're going to go Maguire, Varane, uh, and Martinez. So it's a, it's a decent back line. We are going to man mark, basically, Alvarez with Maguire, right? So we've still got three centre-backs, but with Maguire just staying on Alvarez, is that going to negate that problem? We'll find out. In the middle, we're going Casemiro, Amrabat, and Bruno today. The reason being is, you know, I normally play Mainu. It's not going to affect the spirit. But number one, Amrabat's up for it. And number two, Amrabat just gives you more cover, and he's a destroyer. So with him having track back, with him having fighting spirit, that's going to help the team out, I think, more. And you, you need something in the middle there when you've got the likes of Kevin De Bruyne being a Bruyne, you know? guy's unbelievable now on the left hand side today we're going mason mount we're gonna bring him in ganacho's not feeling it he's under the weather as you can see so we'll start mason today we're gonna also start wan -Bissaka. reason being yet again is he's good defensively 94 ball winning 85 aggression i'm not that concerned with him going up and down he'll do what he needs to do i know he can't deliver a whole lot in the box but I'd rather have that cover defensively. Then we've got Ahmad today and Rasmus up top. We're going to start Ahmad because he scored in the last game. Martial is up for it, but like I said, Diallo scored. We'll give him another bash. Uh, Rashford is still out for another four days. So there we go. And that's it. That's the lineup. That's what we're looking for. There is Man City. Very strong team. Bernardo Silva's on the right today. Haaland is on the bench. Why? I don't know. Ask Pep Guardiola and he'll let you know. But Man City are lying in seventh. We're in ninth. If we win today, we close that gap to just a point. If we lose, we're going to be, what, seven points behind them. That's not good enough. So anyway, without further ado, I will see you guys there at the Etihad. Let's see how we do, folks. So here we are, folks. Uh, it was a nice bright white screen at the beginning. I hope that's not how the match is going to look. No, it looks good. I was going to say what's going on. But yeah, the audio is blasting my ear hole off here. And yes, I'm still working on the site. And I keep mentioning it. That's why I don't mention it anymore. It will be there when it's there. And when it's there, it will be there. But until then, it won't be there. But anyway, today we're focused on City. We try and get back to winning some games uh, in the Barclays Premier League because it's been far too long. But uh, away we go. We're on a 94 spirit. If the team don't feel good today, then I don't know what to say. But we're going to just hold that shape. We are playing counter-attack. We're going for that now instead of possession. And we're going to confuse the, the forward line, playing flexible as well. But the facts are, Man City, you know, look, they haven't had the best start to the season. They're lying in seventh place. It's very unusual for them, but clearly they're starting to pick up a little bit of traction here. Is Kyle Walker. Well played, Martinez. Here's Kevin De Bruyne with an effort. Big deflection. And it's a corner. Nope, he's going to fire that high towards the back post. Yeah, if Bernardo Silva won that header, absolutely no chance. And Alvarez went for the specialty. And City coming out the gates, flying, as you would expect. But yeah, I think Harry Maguire here, there's that man marking for you. Just did enough with his big dome. 
to put him off. Right, some space out here. Look at this. Nice room for uh, Mason Mount. No. That's all right. Get up. Come on, Rodri. We know he's a pain in the backside. Good play there, Mason. And you missed it. And so here is Bernardo Silva. Wants to give it back to him. De Bruyne. Get on him, please, lads. Carl Walker. This is always about just basically getting through this. That's all we have to do right now is try not to concede because normally when I say that, we do concede. But right now, can't get the ball off Walker and they can't get the ball off City. Comes back to Kovacic. That's a loose touch. And now we do have possession, and here we go. Oh, it's a dreadful pass to Amrabat there. Phil Foden. Ooh, that was a little bit naughty. <sighs> Come on, don't give him a card. Don't need it after nine minutes. Disastrous. I mean, you know, it's a good old wan -Bissaka challenge, isn't it? Don't have a chance for De Bruyne. And that's going to be all day for Bayern Deer. All right, let's go. Okay. Go on, Mason. That's fine. You know what? That's not a bad idea because if Ahmad can steal it, which he isn't going to do that, all the way back to Stefan. Oh, where's the other keeper? No Edison today. Right. Manchester United finally have possession. Here we go. Martinez. Mason Mount. I mean, look at them just pressing me. Pressing me, it's non stop. Kevin De Bruyne now back to Rodri and Kanji. Phil Foden. Oh, it's a lovely pass, and there's the goal all over the place. Absolutely all over the place. Who's that? Kovacic. Yeah, Ten Hag says, What's the matter with the team? Ah, we're not defending, mate. That's the matter with the team. There's far too many gaps, far too many holes. More holes than Swiss cheese. And look at that. That's a great pass. And right there, what are you going to do? Nothing. Right, well, Ten Hag's made a few tactical tweaks here. We're actually uh, we're going to go more aggressive. We have to go more aggressive here. This is not working out. Man City are not giving us any time on the ball at all. And every time we get the ball, we just end up losing it. But you can see the, the give and goes, the one-twos. It's impossible to contain. He's not going to keep that alive. Got to pray for us here, folks. Look how high they're playing. Right, give that to Wambasaka. He's on that yellow card now, but uh, he'll be all right. That's all right. Nice one, too. Sometimes it works out. Kovacic, get away from him. Whip it in. Hoyland! Oh, my. Out of absolutely nothing. Man United could have been back level there. That's a great challenge. But look at that. Just quickly got it down the flanks. Strike from Hoyland and nearly did the business. And uh, now we've got problems. Foden against Juan Basaka. Get it out, Maguire. Lovely header, Harry. This has given me anxiety, folks. But you know what? This is once again why I love these games. It feels like I'm away from home. It feels like I'm playing a Man City side that just doesn't give you any breathing room. Which is exactly what you get when you take on Man City. Wambasaka couldn't get there with that pass because it was a shocker. Now we've left a big hole. Alvarez looking to strike it. Nothing wrong with that. What are we doing, lads? Amrabat. Just enough to get in the way of it, but it continues to be full throttle from the team in blue. I'm really hoping second half this changes. I mean, I'll take a 1-0 at the moment because we just can't get out. Right, give it a wan -Bissaka. I know what you guys will be saying. What are you playing a 3-5-2 for then? That's nothing to do with the formation. Play a 4-3-3. It'll still be the same. It's just about finding the ways out right now. Finding the right players. Does it feel like I'm on a 94? Absolutely not. Feels like I'm on a 74. But it's all right. No, didn't want to do that. Wanted him to take a touch. Said he let it run through the pecker. Ball's flicked on. Well done, Amrabat. Just give that back to Bayern Deer. We're not taking any more gambles. I think we might have to we might have to stretch a little bit more. I'm not finding the midfield at the moment. All right, here we go. Mason. Give it to Bruno. We haven't found Bruno Fernandes at all so far. Here's Hoyland. Flick it off. Ref. Is that a foul? It is a foul. All right. I was going to try and take the quick one, but we didn't. But yeah, Aki just... No, it wasn't Aki. It was uh, Rodrigo. 
Do we have a go? Do we have a go from here? No one's really got anything too crazy, but you know what? Let's try a real bendy, bendy McBender. Right there. Go on, Bruno. Top bin, son. Wasn't a bad effort. Keeper had to do what he had to do. But it's just the movement from City. Possible to try and keep keep uh, keep them contained. We've got players moving left, right, up, down. That's all right, Bruno. Just hit it. Right. Nod it on. Oh, here we go. No, you big plonky donkey. You got, <laughs> got in his own way. Well, that was a chance. That was a chance. Man City not really playing with width here. They're, they're playing it through the middle. Bernardo still... I just can't get the ball off him. It's relentless. De Bruyne. Well done, Harry. Well done, Harry. Ahmad. Go on. This could be it here. <sighs> Hoyland. Hoyly, Hoyly. De Bruyne again. Alvarez. Close down this time, and that is well wide. Take the throw. Through the legs. There you go. Right, switches on. And that is a good ball, you know. Hoyland, make the run. Oh, go on, Hoyland. Flick it back. Mason Mount. <sighs> Should I shoot that? Should I not? I was like, the angle's pretty tight. Right, let's swing it round again. Flick it. Lovely. That's the ball. Ahmad, Hoyland, oh, if he went near post, that could have been a beautiful goal. And that's basically what we're looking for here, lads, is a quick counters. I said, it's all, it's Man United, there we go. Go on, Amrabat. Comes forward, Hoyland, that's not enough peppers. <laughs> We've had chances. No, Harry, don't get pulled out, mate. You're meant to be man-marking Alvarez. Oh, we had our chances. De Bruyne trying to find the other way. Right, just calm it and just blow the whistle ref for half time. Oh, as much as we've been absolutely dominated that half. Ten Hag will be saying, yes, we had chances. Hoyland attempts possession. Four attempts to three. I don't know why I do that face. But yeah, look at that. 63%. We've been outplayed by an absolute mile. But we're still in this, so... All right, let's crack on. Right, so Ten Hag has made a tactical focused change. That's right. We have moved Ahmad on the left-hand side. Mason Mount, look, this is what's happening. We're not getting enough up top, right? So there's no point at the moment playing two up there. So we're going to kind of drop off Mason Mount and basically tell him to get involved um, as an AMF. That's a late one, ref. You can, you can play on if you want. Well, now you can bring it back and you can give him a card and we'll say thank you very much. There we go. Beautiful. That's right. De Bruyne does need to update his hair. Now he's got those long flowing... I don't really know what you would call them, but that certainly was a foul. Right, we're going to pump this one up the line. Let's see if Ahmad reacts quick enough. He does react quick enough. Also forgot this is a derby match. So as we know, derby matches are mental. So you're, you're already going to have a handicap before you've even started. Here there is a foul. Bernardo Silva. Caught him there, apparently. Let's just do this. Right, let's give the one-two. Right, Mason. Bruno. Oh, penalty! Nah, he mugged him right off. It's a good challenge in the end. A chance now for Man City. To bring it forward. Goal to the good. Thanks to a Kovacic finish. Finish. Finish in the first half. Took it well. And you'll have to say Man City have dominated this game. But Man United have chances. Hoyland's tested the goalie a couple of times. Stephenson's done well when needed to. Oh, Martinez. Not a great pass there. Well done, Amrabat, though. And now we've got Mason Mount. Try to find his man. Let that roll out. We'll take the throw. Mambasaka. Amrabat. Casemiro. What are we looking for? Hoyland. It's not a good pass, Casemiro. We've got to find Hoyland. Fantastic. But give it to his feet. Give it to the wrong team. Rodri. Alvarez. Maguire, you've let him go. Carl Walker got beaten far too easily and that is the uh, for us the right side of the post for Man City the wrong side of the post good play though isn't it 
I don't know if he should change this and just go out wide. I don't, I don't know what's going to work here against this team. They're relentless, folks. Right, we're going back to once again. I, I've just got to keep switching it because until something clicks, it's not happening. But we're going to go possession football again. Maybe that would be better. We'll see. Anyway, Amrabat. But you can just see City. They don't care, do they? If they have to kill you, they'll kill you. The movement's not there either. Here is uh, Julian Alvarez now. Feeds it inside. Bruno, you were there. And then he ran off. And there's an attempt. And we'll have that all day, every day. Launch it to Ahmad. Well played, Ahmad. Lovely play there, mate. Bruno inside to Amrabat. Looking for the switch. wan -Bissaka. Go on. Get back to him. There you go. Someone come near post. And that will do! Hoyle, hoyle! What a piece! Look at that, see? It does work because Man City are so gun-ho. If you can find a way through, you'll find a way through. And wan -Bissaka, of all players, getting the assist. And Rasmus is back on the score sheet, finally. But this was lovely. Look at that. One, two, over the top. Hoyland is making the run. No one's tracking him. And he's not going to miss from seven and a half yards and a change oh here we go here we go the big man's coming on Haaland's been summoned they're excited right well this is one of my worries to be fair um, is us conceding from set pieces and corners because we can't defend them it's going to be De Bruyne it's a dangerous ball Haaland went for the specialty come on Mason Get it out. Well done. That's great play. Right, Hoyland, win that header. You're in. Ooh. De Bruyne's already... It'd be hilarious if he sends him off. No chance. Go on, get him off. Get him off, ref. I'll give you 20 bucks after the game. Well, 20 quid. We're not in America. But yeah. I mean, he was all over him. He was all over him. All right, we'll take the short one very quickly. Wan Bissaka, get up the line. All right. He's got no support, though, and that's one of the problems. Casemiro. Martinez. Jeez Louise! That is horrendous. Are you having a laugh? He didn't even book him. <laughs> that's the worst challenge all game. I mean, he's got that from martial arts. Nothing. Not even a yellow card and he's pleading. Yeah, clearly there's something going on there. Right, I'm going to try and hit the corner here. I was having a look at making subs, but I don't... This is the thing. I don't want to take wan off. And the reason being is obviously he's a better defender than the likes of Anthony. Um, and he's also... You know, I know he's on a yellow though, and that's the worrying thing too. So... Uh, but if I bring Anthony on, are we going to get caught down the flanks? Possibly. And then... You know, it's a waste of time. Rasmus might come off shortly anyway, and we'll bring on Martial. So we'll see what we can do there. But we've got 20 minutes to play. Obviously, we still want to go here and try and win this. Ahmad. Bruno. Hoyland, you're in. Lovely pass. Who's in the box now? Rasmus. Beautiful. Referee. I want the foul. And book him, please, because I'm getting sick of it now. You can't keep letting them off. Aki's already fouled us numerous times this game. He's still not giving him a card. How's this not a yellow? I mean, it's good play from Rasmus. Clips him. Right, he's going to come off. Right, so we are going to bring on Hoyland. We're not going to bring on Hoyland. We're taking him off. Uh, we are bringing on Martial because he's run a good shift. He's knackered. And you never know, Martial might do something, folks. But we do have a pretty good chance here. We scored from a from a set piece against Porto by getting it towards Harry here. Let's see if we can do the same thing. Ball's fired in. Get up, get up, get up. Oh, it's come back here. It's Amrabat. Oh! Ho, ho! Amrabat, he is not a twatty. And that will do. What a screamer of a finish. And we have turned this game on its head. 
It's those balls in. They are causing all sorts of problems. Now, if Edison's in goal, he probably would have saved this. Maybe, maybe not. But the keeper decided to parry it. And look at that for a volley. Woohoo! It is pinpoint. I was honestly thinking about taking off Amrabat for Mainu about five minutes ago. I said, we're not going to do it. And then he pulls out this. <sighs> well, we've got to have a look at this from another angle. Because to me... That's a specialty. Let's have a look at this. We're going to go to Amrabat as well because you've got to get that perfect angle. There he is, lining it up. He saw the ball come in. He saw the technique. And then, bang! As soon as he hit that, look at it. Beautiful. So, from a goal down, Manchester United lead. Two goals to one, but there's still 15 minutes left. Oh, there is a lot of time to spare. We need to keep the shape. Kovacic. Bernardo Silva. Here's Bob, who's come on now. Martinez, just going to hoof it clear. And this is all we're going to do now. Martin, go on, Martial. He's got the legs because they're fresh. Fresh as you like. Keeper's coming out. And it's absolutely tripe. Come on, Martial. Better than that, mate. But look at that. Ball over the top. Aki's looking tired. He should be on a yellow. So should numerous Man City players at this point. Clearly the referee's a fan. And, uh, oh, get it out again. Well done, Casemiro. Just clear it into touch. Well, we're going all defensive, folks. We have brought on Luke Shaw. Dallow's come on for wan -Bissaka. I wouldn't normally do it. I'd normally put more attacking on. But, oh, oi, 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 oi. Okay, into the side netting, fortunately. As I said, I need that cover. Defensive awareness is imperative when you're 10 minutes away from a big result and you don't want to do anything silly. But Martial, he had a chance to grab that third. But Man City, as you can see, because they're pushing so many players forward, there's chances, there's gaps, and that's a shockingly bad ball in from Dallo. All right, Dallo, get back, please. He's launched it. I mean, if we can win this game with Amrabat finishing like that, <sighs> no complaints. Still a lot of time, though. Doku, Bob, Kovacic. Gonna keep Haaland quiet. Stay on him. Here is Haaland. There's Les Maguire getting in there, son. Well played. Aki wins the header. Just basically 11 red shirts behind the ball here. Kanji. Doku now. Go on, Luke Shaw. And that's why we brought Luke Shaw on. <sighs> Didn't keep it on, though. There's Carl Walker now to Bob. Man City going to want to get this ball in as soon as they can. Doku back to Walker. Kovacic. Walker. Back to Akanji. It's just patient play from City here. Walker, stay on him, Casemiro. Don't do anything silly. Back to Doku. Get it out. No, no, not to Haaland. Get it out, Casemiro. Rodri, it's all Man City. Martial, get up. That'll do. Two minutes left plus stoppage. How much stoppage time? Please don't be a lot. I don't know. There's going to be four minutes. You're having a laugh. Clearly, they've been paying them off. Haaland. Maguire, who's just been brilliant today. Just been exceptional with his man marking. And sometimes you have to do it. Here's Bob once again. Two minutes to spare. We are sweating all over the shop. Get it out, please. Haaland. Just boot it anywhere. Martial, that will do. Get it forward now. Martial, make the run. Make the roll. What a ball that is. What a ball it is. It's Martial, folks. Finish. And it will do. Woohoo! Three goals to one. We're cooking today. And that will do. This, honestly, this has felt so much like a Man United, Man City match. It's unbelievable. We've just mugged them off, basically, from counter-attacking. And that's what's happened here. What a pass this is from Mason. This ball is exceptional. Right over the top, on a plate. Stefan comes out, thought he was going to come out, and I said, sod it, we'll keep going. And Martial, take a bow, son. Take a bow. And it looks like that's going to finish it. Three goals to one. Silence at the Etihad. <laughs> and we'll close that gap to one point. But that, that, that man, Amrabat, the bald magician, 
with an exceptional finish to really get the ball rolling. And then it was all about defending. Harry Maguire, by the way, brilliant at the back. I'll give him a mention because he did what he needed to do. He had no possession. He stole it. Nine attempts to seven. And there it is. Amrabat man of the match. But yeah, I thought Maguire, a six. I thought he did well. And also Hoyland, a worth a mention. And of course, uh, Martial coming on and scoring. Fantastical. Oh, blimey. I have to change my shirt. I'm sweating so much. But anyway, there is the results. Aston Villa beat Nottingham Forest. Arsenal beating Chelsea. Everton losing against West Ham. Bournemouth nil. Sheffield United one. Tottenham two. Burnley nil. Fulham drew against Luton. Liverpool did beat Brentford. Newcastle drew against Crystal Palace. And Wolves losing to Brighton and Hove Albion. So we do stay ninth. Bit of a shame. I was hoping we'd go up, but we couldn't because we weren't close enough. But we have closed the gap to five points um, on Wolves, who are lying in fourth place. It's pretty tight, isn't it, to be honest? And then you're looking at Tottenham, Arsenal and Liverpool there, top three. Chelsea still down. That's what I mean, talk about realism. Look at Chelsea. They know, they know. And Crystal Palace are having a nightmare. Bottom of the table, Luton and Brentford are your bottom tray. All right, so we've got a nice long break. So that's good. The players can get rested and hopefully they'll be up for this match here against the Wolves. Oh, we're taking on Wolves. This is a humongous game. All right, so we got to win this one too. If we do win it, we close the gap on Wolves to just two points. Uh, why is Ganacho still down? It's not terrible, though, is it? All right, before we do pick a lineup, I do want to have a look at this. What's going on? We have some... Oh, I need to go in here and do this, don't I? All right, so these are some of the options they're saying regarding scouting. Um, let me make myself a little bit smaller. So, Daniel Pedence. I mean, honestly, I would get rid of Anthony, to be honest, and try and replace him with a decent winger. Podence could be a good option, but he's also 28 now. Marata, no thanks. Now, Sebastian Vea, if you guys remember this guy, which you won't if you didn't play my Everton playthrough. Oh, he looks different now because he's got older. But he was a good player. I enjoyed him. That sounds a bit wrong. But I enjoyed playing with him. That also sounds wrong. I enjoyed playing on the pitch with him. Yeah? Come on. So, And he's got a lot of player skills, so... Yeah, there's a good amount of options there with him. And I don't think he's too pricey. 35 million. Decent affection. I've also got Fofana, um, centre midfielder. Who's this guy? 24? Not bad. Rafael Leo. Now, this guy could be an option. I'm not even joking with you. He, although, it's his final... Oh, the final season. Could we get him for free? They are interested in selling him. Hmm... So yeah, Rafael Leo could be an option. I'm going to watch because he's, yeah, he's exceptional, isn't he? He's got such good speed. His dribbling isn't bad either. And I imagine having him on the flanks. But obviously with me, I am playing a 3-5-2. So he's going to be up and down. He obviously hasn't got the best defensive awareness and it's pants. But he could play as a forward as well. Uh, and then Hakim Ziyech. Yeah, I mean, he's a little bit older now, 30. I want to try and get someone around 25 and younger. So anyway, let me know your thoughts on that. Um, let me quickly do this. What should we go for? We do need a new forward, I would say. So we'll go center forward. We'll focus on Europe, which is what I normally do. And we'll go on still developing. I want a player that's developing. Also, who else do we want to try and get up? Well, this is... This is... Bolster weak spots, which is fine. Let's put that in Europe as well. And we'll do this on still developing. All right. So then this one. Maybe one more cent. I would like a really good center back. You know, Harry Maguire stepped up, but I think midfielder all right. I do think another really solid center back could help the team. We'll put that in Europe. And I also want to say, and I want them to develop. I want to develop these players. So, yeah, we'll go for that. All right. Anyway, I'm going to pick a lineup for this match against the Wolves. Cool, blimey. They're playing 5-2-3. So we really need to dominate the midfield. But I'm sure that's obviously going to change with the fluid formation. Okay. 
This could be a mad game. But anyway, let me pick a lineup. We'll be back. All right, folks, so we're not doing massive changes. I feel like we beat Man City 3-1 away. I mean, granted, yeah, we didn't do a whole lot possession-wise, but you got to reward the players, right? They did well. So we're going to bring back Unana in goal just because he does have better reflexes and awareness than Bayern Deer. Like, you saw that goal that they scored, Alvarez. I mean, it wasn't even that far away from the goalie, and he just ignored it. So we'll bring back Unana. Not that I rate him that much. Uh, Harry Maguire, the guy's buzzing. Actually, what we will do is, once again, do the old man marking. I mean, I'm fine with doing man marking when we have three at the back, centre-back-wise. When we only have two centre-backs, man marking never works because if one player runs out, that centre-back buggers off, and now you've got one centre-back there against the forward, and it's a mission. So, yeah, that's fine. Martinez is good. Varane's buzzing, which is nice. We'll start wan again. Thought he did all right. Why not? Now, the middle of the pitch, and we're going to go for the same midfield. I did want to start Maynou today, but it drops us down a little bit, and I want to have Amrabat in there as a destroyer with Casemiro as an anchor man. We're going to start Ahmad on the left. I want to develop him and actually try and evolve him. And, you know, he can kind of play on the left. He's fine. And then Bruno in the hole with uh, Anthony Martial. He came on and scored. We've got to reward him. Uh, and then Rasmus up there as well. And then we've got Marcus Rashford. He's back from injury. So he's, he's on the bench as an option. And there we go. There's a look at Wolves. We know they're playing well. So we've got to be careful. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff happens when we lose the ball. All right. I will see you at Old Trafford. Trying to get back to consistently winning, so we'll see. But this is a massive game, huge game. We win today, we close that gap to two points on Wolves. Let's do it. Right, so it's finally not raining. It's a nice day. In December, in England. You wouldn't get that happening, would you? But yeah, it's nice that it's not raining for once. I think the last three matches, the rain's been pouring down. So we are back at home. Back with a full strength team. I mean, look, if I was going to say what are the expectations for this season, top four, you know what I mean? Top four, try and do well in the Champions League. I'm not going to go crazy. We still need extra players. We still got to sell a bunch of players too. You know, and, and honestly, the first season in any Master League is normally the hardest. It's it's a bit of a mess at times. So you've got to really dig deep and do what you can. So anyway, you know what we're going to do here? Just whip that one in. Go on, son. Make some, cause some problems. As, uh, here comes Wolverhampton Wanderers. What a season they're having up in, what, fourth, fourth place? So here's Matt Doherty. So they'll be coming into this match full of confidence and they won't care about where United are in the table. They won't care United beat Man City. Three goals to one away from home. Anyway, here is Rasmus. Ahmad. You're going to get a lot more playing time, Ahmad. I'll tell you that much, mate. You're going to be part of this team. Now we've got a chance. It's a looper. Oh, is it still on? It is. And now it isn't. Chance for the corner. Right. Well, I'll tell you what, Harry Maguire lately has been a right pain in the backside for any team he comes up against. So we're going to whip that ball in towards Harry. It's back to Amrabat. We're not going to shoot that one this time. Bruno's on. Oh, there's a... Oof, through the defender's legs. Good start from United here. Much better. Casemiro. Stretch it out wide here. Ahmad. Cuts back. We'll take that all day. Well, we'll see if this referee's any better than the last referee, because, core blimey, the amount of yellow cards that he should have given to Man City was embarrassing. Clearly, something was going on there, and we all know, you know, moolah-wise. Oh, great again. Stay with him. That's all right. Just hold the shape. Sarabia. Or Sarabia. What are you going to call him? It's a tough one to pronounce. Samiro trying to stay with Doherty. Good possession this from Wolves. Oh, thought we might better steal that. We didn't all day. Struck that beautifully. It's a good save from Anana there. Good possession from Wolves. Taking their time, working it forward. Thought Bruno was going to... I should have dived there to win that. But yeah, nice. What a save. A chance for Wolverhampton Wanderers here from the corner. Delivered high. Good header from Varane. 
Johnny Otto up against Marcia on the touch. Nothing. Rafa. Yeah, just play. Where's he walking off to? Yeah, Marcio apologises. It wasn't anything cynical. What's he? He's asking for a card. That, in turn, is, should be a card for him. He can't do that anymore. I've got a chance again. Fired in. Get up, wan -Bissaka. Does well. Amrabat's there. And he's also completely lost it. But the ref's fair enough to the ref. At least he let him play. You're right, Anthony Martial's going to stretch the legs. Who's making the runs? I've seen Bruno. But we're still doing this ourselves. Right, Hoyland. Near post, mate. Near post. Hoyland's there. You should have heard me, mate. I was telling you, near post. Amrabat. Let's get that wide. Looking for Amat. And it's out for the Manchester United throw. Give it to Bruno. Come on, Amat. Go. Back heel. Oh, that's a shoddy pass there, Bruno. It really is, mate. Got to do better than that. As uh, Wolves now start to dictate. Otto. I mean, it does I feel like it does make a difference having Amrabat in there. Because he's um, he's a worker, isn't he? I feel like having Casemiro and him together, it's a good little combo. But I do want to play Mainu because it's Mainu, isn't it? Huge potential in this guy. Casemiro. Amrabat. wan -Bissaka. Well, let's work it round. Varane. Scoops it over the top. Lovely pass to Martinez. It's also where I need Bruno to sort of come to the ball. Here he is. Uh, that's not what I wanted, but... Because he is a whole player, Bruno. Sometimes he just buggers off. You know, and he's, he's sitting on the front line with Marcio and Hoyland. I don't want that. I want Bruno right in the hole, feeding those boys. Johnny Otto. Not Johnny Bravo. Nice one-two ding-dong. Look at this for football. Give goes left, right and centre. Gets it back again. Fires it in. But there's Harry Maguire yet again. Harry Maguire, I'll tell you what, proving his worth at the moment. Martial. Oh, Martial, you're not having a bad, uh, a bad little run at the moment. There's wan -Bissaka. Right, on the touch. We're not going to whip it. That's all right. Martial might steal this. Ah! Doherty once again. Lamina. Oh, Martial. There you go. Brilliant, Anthony. Absolute quality. All right, give it to him. One, two. Now go. We're going to have to do this. You two together. We're back to him. Lovely play. Martial. Oh, and he's brought it back for the fair. But lovely. And Martial, though, he's starting to click. I'll let... Look, I will give Martial the benefit of the doubt if he shows me he's worth it. And at the moment, well, today's episode, he is. Right, well, you know what time it is, and if... Uh, I don't care anymore, as I said about free kicks, because they can score the free kicks against me, and I can score them against them. I'm going right in off the crossbar here. Go on, Bruno! Gonna be Fernandez. <laughs> it's too good! It's too good! What's that? And Ten Hag said, yes! But yeah, right in the corner, no chance for the keeper. It is what it is. Look, we're on legend, so... If they can't save them, they can't save them. But Bruno can certainly put them in the back of the net. One goal to nil. Through the gap to find Ahmad. Bruno Fernandes. And we'll take another foul. We'll take it again, ref. Mugging us off. It's a good play from Bruno there. Did a little bit of a, an ops, opposite double touch. And then uh, Lamina right into him of course he says no but he's partially sighted right should we just do it again I don't care anymore we're going to do it again folks two goals from free kicks it's going to be Bruno Fernandes it's too easy it's the free kick show today <laughs> seriously I'm not that fussed anymore I'm just going to do it we need the points and if you're going to foul me I'm going to do what I need to do. 2-0. I'll see you. wan -Bissaka. Could be possibly, maybe even grab another one here. Go on, get up. Cleared away from the keeper. And that's half time. 
So right now, it's on point. We just need to just need to not concede now, isn't it? Second half. I mean, four attempts to one. We haven't we haven't possessed that well, but we've done enough. So anyway, second half. Here we go. So there is a change for the Wolves. That's right. Kunha has come on to try and uh, solve this problem. I don't know. Maybe we should start playing Wamba Saka more. I feel like we've been we've been better defensively with having Wamba Saka there instead of Dallow. So, you know, maybe. Here is Wambasaka. And say so Wambasaka hasn't got any attacking presence, does he? I mean, he can't really cross and he can't really dribble. But he gives you the option, as I said, when it comes to defending. That's all right. Manchester United now starting off the half by maintaining some possession. Varane starts again. Casemiro. Right, Bruno, you want this? Right to your feet. That's fine. Put it through there. Hoyland, you come into the ball. Nope, we're going to find Bruno instead. And that is a shocking pass. Bit of a loose one. Bruno finding Doherty. Sarabia. Belgarde. All the way around the other way to find Otto. There's Chan. Oh, there, see Amrabat. Amrabat just, as I said, he just gives you extra runnage. There he is again, sticking a foot in. Players that want to move and work off the ball is the players that you want. Well, watch the turn, Harry. Brilliant from Harry there. Just staying on him. Oh, Bruno, careful. Harry again, stay with him. That should be comfortable for Martinez. Just booting it clear. I'll tell you what, might not be a bad ball. Flicked on. Darty once more. Wall's now starting to press. Lamina, Harry Maguire's pulled out. Darty. Rubia. Belgard. All right, stay with them, lads. Doherty. I feel like they need to whip this in at some point. He's going to shoot this. He's going to shoot this. And there's the deflection. Could have gone anywhere. You never know. Yeah, he wanted that on the left peg. He wanted to smack that. And he did hit it. And Casemiro, great defending. Great defending. Chance for Wolves again. They've had a few corners so far this game. But there's Harry again. He's always winning the headers. Oh, that is a loose pass. And away we go. Right, Hoyland now. Find him. Is that the ball? Oh, it just needed to be a fraction higher, Martial. And Rasmus would have been in. Otto. Lovely one-two. Has to deliver it. Does deliver! And he should have done better. And that's the threat that Wolves still offer you. Nice play. One, two, the gives and goes. And I like to think Harry Maguire maybe put him off enough. Right, so we're going to take off Bruno. Wouldn't normally happen and Ten Hag would never do it. No, because Bruno is my player. He is the greatest player in the team. He is the captain. But look, you can take him off, Ten Hag, okay? You take Bruno off sometimes. You can bring on Mason Mount. He'll do something for you. So anyway, on comes Mason. Uh, I know Bruno was actually on course for a hat-trick, but oh well. I'd rather have um, probably Mason's... Well, we also Mason's on form today, and Bruno isn't, so... He's on neutral. But don't want to change too much at the current time. Number second. Varane. Or is it round two, Martinez? I'll look at wan Bissaka's calling for it, but um, no, 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 Martinez. Don't be a plum. Okay, are we really going to concede a goal from me being a twat? Doherty, get it out! Well done, Harry, again. The guy is having one hell of an episode, isn't he? Amrabat, here we go. That's the ball! Oh, it needed a fraction more peppers. We are that close to getting behind. I mean, we're just defending at the moment, but you can't do much. Once again, Maguire is... Maybe we don't need another centre-back. Maguire's turned into a machine. Amrabat. Not Amrabat. Ahmad. He's lost possession. Sarabia's too quick for him. Cunha. Sounds like Cunha Matata. Balls play through the middle. Oh, Nana, please get up, mate. Well done. So we'll make three changes. 
we will bring on Rashford, Mainu, and also Anthony. Yeah, we're bringing Anthony on. He's going to play on the left. Apparently, he can't play on the left. His brain can't figure it out, but he's going to have to figure it out because that's where we've put him. Ten Hag said, yes, you cost me a lot of money. You're going to have to figure your life out, please. So here he is, Anthony. Straight, straight away, that's what Anthony does. Goes offside. Ridiculous, son. There's your pass completion. We've only had about 79%. It hasn't been great, to be honest. Anyways, Rashford. Whee! Hey! Straight through the old legs. Casemiro. Mason. Now, here is Anthony now. Poke it. Not a great pass, was it? There's uh, Sarabia. Wolves need a goal, and they need one fast here. Only seven minutes left in a big, big match. They lose this. They will go. Well, two points ahead of United from being five points ahead as uh, the ball's fired in. Once again, Harry, you're just not beating him today. Rashford, lovely little touch. And Rasmus Hoyland now has got a lot of green ahead of him. But there isn't much on. Mainu. Rashford, Mainu. Lovely play. Mainu, as soon as he comes on, does the business. Hoyland, Mason mounts. Oh, probably should have gone for the other corner and we're going to let that run out of play. Oh, look at that. As soon as Maynou's on, the little bit of composure that the young 18-year-old has. Poked that one through. Should have gone for the other side because the goal he'd already committed. <sighs> a change for Wolves. The ball is fired in. Hoyland. Anthony. It's going to be Maynou! Oh! Hoo -hoo -hoo. That took a few deflections. After scoring that Amrabat goal, I was like, all right, let's just have a go now. Took one, two, I think three, two, three deflections. and Applauds himself. He's got a little bit of a wide head, but his face is definitely better than the default one. Right, Harry Maguire, the living legend. Can he win that flick on? He can! Oh, ho, ho, cleared off the line. Lamina gets it away. And it is now Kuna up against, well, three red shirts. Wambasaka, I'm just going to stay with this guy over here. Although Wambasaka's looking tired. Here is Gonzalez. Please stay on him, lads. Let's not concede one now. And yeah, put the pressure us pressure. Put the pressure on us, should I say, for the final two minutes. That's fine. Waste a bit of time. I mean, it's a foul. So a final chance for Wolves. Can they get maybe some sort of consolation? Not with Harry Maguire. How many headers has Harry Maguire won today? We are going to have a look after this game. Final minute to play. Ball's fired in. Comes back to Belgard. And the referee. It's always Casemiro with his arms. Loves to punch people, apparently. He used to be an ex-boxer, apparently. But yeah, he did kind of mug him off. But anyway, this will be... The final chance. We're not going to move the goalie. Let's see if he does the business. Uh, took a deflection, and it's going to be a corner. That's why the wall does the job. Ooh. See? My wall does its job. This Wolves his own fault if they don't. So here it is, the final chance. Doherty. And that's our ball ref, and he blows for full time. Manchester United today getting the job done. Yeah, it was two free kicks. Get over it. You'll be fine. I mean, you wouldn't complain in real life, right? If Man United scored two free kicks. We never score free kicks, by the way. But if you scored two penalties, you just go, all right, next. But there it is. Six attempts to five. I mean, we got out-possessed again, but we were taking on a pretty strong Wolves team. And Bruno Fernandes, your man of the match. But let's have a real quick look here. I do want to see Maguire. How many headers did he win? Did it? Does it tell you how many? I don't think it does, really, does it? Tackles. Didn't win any. Got seven clearances. Seven clearances for Maguire. That's pretty impressive, considering the rest of these is two, two, two... Varane only had two. Martinez only one. So yeah, Maguire, beautiful. 
So, the other result. So, Man City bounced back. Uh, they did beat Nottingham Forest. Chelsea did beat Aston Villa. That actually helps us out. So, thank you, Chelsea. West Ham drew against Arsenal. Beautiful as well. Uh, Sheffield United also beat Everton. Everton up there? They might be. Burnley won. Bournemouth 4. Tottenham did win again. Blimey, Tottenham are playing well. Brentford won. Fulham won. Newcastle lost to Liverpool. They continue to win. And Crystal Palace continue to lose 4-2 against Brighton. So we have moved up a couple of places to seventh. We are now only three points behind West Ham, who are now fourth. Wolves dropped down to fifth. Man City up to sixth. And uh, yeah, Tottenham, Arsenal and Liverpool, your top three. Bottom of the table, Crystal Palace having a mare down there with Luton and Brentford. Newcastle aren't doing well either. So folks, we have two more matches and then we open up the transfer window. So I need you guys to let me know uh, who you think might be some good players to pick up. It looks like Ganacho has introduced the double touch. Very, very nice. All right, folks. So anyway, we'll return in the next episode. As I said, I'm going to keep bashing these out. Got to get back to it now because I do enjoy it. Like when I sit down and play these games, I do enjoy doing them. But it's, you know, it's a different scenario than sitting down on a Friday night playing in front of your TV and you don't really care, right? But anyway, we'll be back shortly. Subscribe for more and take care.